The term neuroplasticity simply means that it is possible to rewire the human brain. <coughs> this is huge in learning disabilities. Okay, this is one of my areas of interest. What they're finding is that if you take a child who's say 10 years old with significant learning disabilities, the studies were done with 100 hours of remedial activity that they were able to actually rewire the brain to function in a new and productive way, basically overcoming the disability. But the disability was the function of how the neurons were firing to begin with, and they're discovering that through certain types of programmed behavioral activity, the brain will rewire itself. Now, we always knew this was true, okay? We knew this was true in stroke victims. We knew it would rewire and certain uh, activities would return. Uh, we've known this in <coughs> addicts who are able to overcome their addiction by literally creating new sets of neurons that, that, that result in a different behavior. Okay? We also know about addiction is that the neurons that, that for that addiction don't die off, it's like they went and sat on the bench. Okay? My, my brother quit smoking for 17 years, and he smokes again. Okay? And he told me that. He says that the Surgeon General had come out tomorrow and said smoking's okay, he said I would have started smoking immediately. Okay, so he was still, and he still had this whole set of neurons for that addiction. Okay. And this is what I was talking about. The correct skill building protocol can be used to change and rewire the brain.